Hello guys and welcome to Disney Dreamlight Valley Reddit Review Part 2. You loved Part 1 so much and I enjoyed making it a lot. So we're doing Part 2 today and uh, let's see. I might get inspired, I might get entertained, or maybe both. That's going to be the best case scenario. Let's jump right into it. Hey, but remember, my stock isn't always the same. Oh, that mannequin is always there, man. That's a lie. Don't lie to me never lie to me <laughs> oh that's true that's there's a few items that are just always there and it's annoying bmo is backpack so proud of this one this is a custom designed backpack i've never tried designing backpacks but how did you make these shapes so tiny am i missing something I mean, I mean, is it backpacks or just different? Because I wouldn't be able to make circles this tiny on any piece of clothing. I hope backpacks are different and you can actually do things like that, like really make things small. Unless there is a trick to make things this small that I don't know about. If there is, please let me know in the comments. Sick backpack though. Okay, so after having an all empty accessory table yesterday, I found this today. Apology accepted, Scrooge. Four hairstyles. So people like hairstyles. I don't know why. Like it's it's like from what I've been seeing so far in the Reddit, it's like having a hairstyle in the shop is like the best day ever. I feel like I have all of these hairstyles. Probably just been buying them from Scrooge and not even paying attention. But is this a hairstyles really this rare? Why why are people so excited about them? Someone complimented me at work today and said, and I said, thank you kindly. <laughs> what has Scrooge done to me? I've never said it in my life. I feel like I do that too, like, I'm not sure if I said this particular f phrase, but I, I do remember saying something that one of the characters said, and I was like, oh my god, I learned it from the game. That is funny. And it, it is a nice thing. Scrooge taught us a nice lesson. Be kind to people. Well done. I love celestial items, but struggled with how to incorporate them to my village. So I decided to give Merlin a grand entrance to his home, completed with a wishing well. Oh my god. This is amazing. This is incredible. Yeah, celestial items look incredible. I, I feel like the columns... Me personally, I like using them inside. I feel like they, they really look good inside the rooms. I don't know about the flags. Maybe if I make a Merlin's bedroom, which whenever it's his birthday is, I probably will. I, I will definitely use them in, in his bedroom. <laughs> it looks sick though. Well done. Very good design. Was finally able to get the last rare item I needed from Scrooge's shop. My room is now complete. Which... Wait, are you saying you got every single item from Scrooge's store? That's impossible. Oh. <laughs> That makes more sense. <laughs> this is so funny. This is... I literally see this lamp every single day. And this table. And this fireplace. I have like 20 of them. Oh my god. I thought I was the only one. Oh, this is genius. <laughs> oh, this is funny. Oh, I just noticed that my Chrome didn't shut up correctly. I'm sorry. That message was bothering you? I hope not. <laughs> Damn. Uh, now I know I'm not I'm not the only one. I'm not alone. There's a few other items that I see all the time, but definitely I recognize every single of these items, and I caught myself a few times seeing it like, I just had this yesterday. Why is it still here? Hilarious. To all of you guys saying the main menu has a bad design for putting new game right below continue. It's a very common design. I really don't understand why so many in the sub press new game unintentionally when no other game has this problem. I've never pressed new game unintentionally. What? How? How do you press it unintentionally? It literally says new game on it. And it makes sense for continue to be on top. Do you want it to be the other way around? Like, what? what's the problem? How would you... I don't get it. I've never seen comments like that, but I didn't even know that was a problem. That, that That's interesting. That's interesting to know. I recreated this classic meme today. <laughs> that's true look at her face look at ariel's face it looks exactly like the meme look whoop whoop 
Eric. Eric, you dog. Look at his face. He he is checking her out. Definitely. By the way, gorgeous. Gorgeous avatar. As a newly created woman in Disney Dreamlight Valley, I appreciate it tremendously. Well done. Let the feast begin. I'm a sucker for anything Harry Potter. I've seen this in the, my last Reddit review. This time it has food on the tables. Wow, you made a lot of recipes. This is incredible. I'm sure I'm sure everybody will appreciate the, the meals. What weird things do your residents do? I frequently find Scar reading at Merlin's. Well, Donald... Donald is just being Donald. No matter where I go, I, I can always hear him, his tantrums. Uh, Scar usually don't see him that much, but whenever I do, he is... Uh, pretty much chilling i tried to make him fly a few times like i saw i saw some videos on youtube the glitch where scar just like flying while he's lying down that, that looked funny but i couldn't make him do this so that was kind of sad um what else wally he is showing off his plant all the time and he looks cute as a button that's pretty much it cozy loft oh my god this looks good that wallpaper, everything matches so well. And the filter, the filter makes it just looks like a freaking movie. And the wind, it's only possible because of the windows, the, the, the way they did the light nowadays. Oh my God. Oh, I just unlocked this kelp. I just unlocked it a few days ago. That is, that is cool. I love it. Wow, this bed also, I think I have it. God, this is beautiful. I've never, never thought about using the trellis inside the room. And it's brilliant. My niece isn't allowed to have a Reddit, but she really wanted me to share her dress creations. Oh, these are nice. Oh, Christmas. These are pretty cool designs. Oh my god, this is nice. A little yellow dress. Oh! I have this water motif. That looks sick. I'm gonna try to do this some, something similar. She is really talented. This is really good designs. How old is she, I wonder? Oh, how do you make like different color on top and the bottom? I mean, I haven't tried to design a dress yet. I, I mostly design men's clothing, but... I will design a dress for my 6,000 subscribers. So, subscribe. We're almost there. Let's let make me make a beautiful dress. I promise it's going to be gorgeous. So, subscribe right now. Thank you so much. Let's continue. Oh, that is a nice. Oh, I like this. This is this looks kind of like a real dress. Like I can imagine this dress existing in real life. Nice. Ooh, that's pretty. Nice colors. Oh. <gasps> It looks like snow. Wow. How did you... Oh, I, ha I think I have this motif. That's that's a very, very creative use of it, though. That's amazing. Damn. Very, very good job. Oh! Oh, this looks gorgeous. It's so simple, but also so beautiful. Again, looks like a real design from real world. I'm in love. Well done. Well done. Made a cozy neighborhood for Mickey and his friends. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. How the hell do you guys come up with this? Look at this. Little nice neighborhood, and you can't really wander anywhere. Imagine all the spices and all the uh, holes coming out of, that you don't have to worry about. Brilliant. Just brilliant. After the holidays, like next week. I'm gonna do a live stream and we're gonna start uh, designing. Sorry guys, I've been pretty busy the last couple of weeks. I couldn't stream. And like after Thanksgiving, by the way, happy Thanksgiving. I think this video is gonna be coming out right on Friday, I wanna say. It's Friday, it's Black Friday. Happy Black Friday, happy Thanksgiving. You are amazing, eat a turkey. Good night. <laughs> Sorry, it's it's not it's not night yet. Let's, let's go back to, to, to looking at memes. This mannequin keeps showing up in Scrooge's store. The stupid little mermaid table, a bane of my li life in this game. It's the same items. It's it's everybody. It's not just you. You're not alone. But we are stronger together. 
I knew I had to hop online today. Ooh, that is a sick hairstyle. Sea swept pearl pinned hairdo. Damn. That looks sick. Is anyone else annoyed by the fact that furniture you own can still appear in Scrooge's store? Okay, so about this one, I think it's fine. Because otherwise, if we always get unique items every day, then uh, we, 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 we would just collect every single furniture and closing item in the game within like 2-3 weeks. And then what do you do? That's literally... This is the end game. I truly believe, in my experience, that certain items have certain rarity. So it's like common items, rare items, maybe like epic rarity, legendary rarity. Some items are super rare that barely anyone ever sees. And if you manage to, like, if you don't buy it when you see it, it's gone for a long time. So that's why I highly recommend checking Scrooge's store every day because... You can get some super rare items and snag them and be happy. Wow, some, some more epic dress designs. This one is amazing. Wow. Wow. Su such a good use of motifs. Such a, such a, wow. Okay, this is next level stuff. Holy crap. Oh, -ho, celestial dress. Oh man, I want to design a dress so badly. And it fits the hair too. Oh, that's sick. That's that's gorgeous. Like some motifs, I look at them and I'm like, I don't know how I would even use it. It doesn't seem like you can use it, but I feel like there's use for every single motif in this game. You just need to find it. You need to find a perfect design. Ho oh, ho ho, this looks good. And look at this cake, little cake crocodile. It matches perfectly. <laughs> oh, that is... Oh, that chocolate is just dripping. I want to lick it. You want to lick it from the dress. <laughs> wow. I'm inspired. I'm going to create the most beautiful dress. At 6,000 subscribers. Subscribe now. <laughs> I'm so shameless. Just wanted to share my enthusiasm for the game. Friends give me a hard time for liking it. Same here. I literally, like... When some people find out that I play Disney Dreamlight Valley, they're like, "But why? It's a, it, it's a kids game." I'm like, "Did you play it? Did you actually play it? You." To be fair, people who say that usually prefer games like FPS, uh, stuff like that. It couldn't be more opposite. But I love it. Like I, I do enjoy an FPS once in a while, but it's all about the balance. This game is so good if you just want to chill if you want to relax if you don't want to get your stress levels pumping like being shot by a billion people you just sit there collect your pumpkins go to scrooge sell stuff it's 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 nice i i appreciate it it's a really nice and on this positive note i think we're gonna end this reddit review thank you so much guys for watching if you want to see this more often if you want to see reddit episodes more often let me know in the comments and leave a like and subscribe. I'm, I enjoy doing this a lot. There's a lot of good ideas you can get from Reddit. Uh, it can make you smile. It can make you laugh. It can make you inspired. It can make you all beautiful sorts of things. So I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much for joining me on this journey. It was fun. Take care.